Hey everyone, so I just wanted to talk about the XRP versus the Securities and Exchange Commission case that's been going on for years. Of course, you know that the judge ruled in favor of Ripple Labs saying that the sale of XRP on the secondary market and to the general public um, is not considered uh, a security. Um, but this was a partial victory because uh, the sale of XRP by Ripple Labs to institutions um, is considered a security. Um, this was essentially an ICO that happened uh, when Ripple Labs first uh, issued XRP. Um, so this was a partial victory, but the price did shoot up um, and XRP is now offered again on Coinbase and uh, Kraken and other exchanges. Um, the old coin market in general shot up um, because you know this is seen as uh, favorable for other uh, altcoins uh, to be not considered a security as well, but a word of caution that this doesn't necessarily set a precedent. Um, each altcoin is different. Um, and while this case could be referenced in the future, it's not necessarily going to set a precedent uh, for every altcoin. Um, nevertheless, the market took it as a uh, very positive um, for tokens that have been deemed securities by the SEC and lawsuits against Coinbase and Binance um, and other companies. Um, so just because, you know, the SEC uh, did suffer a blow, uh, you know, I think these other tokens that have been attacked by the SEC, quote unquote, uh, have also uh, gained in price. Um, but uh, we'll keep an eye on this case. Um, I guess, you know, every victory we can get against the SEC and every step we can take towards uh, new legislation um, instead of this other approach, um, you know, I think will will be great. And uh, I know there's uh, a lot going on when uh, it comes to legislation right now. And uh, perhaps we'll talk about that in a separate video. All right. Thank you.